The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Hello, Central Region. Welcome to our webinar today. My name is Melissa Guzmier. I'm the eFolder Territory Manager for the Central Region. Just want to thank you all for joining us today. As a reminder, all attendees are in listen-only mode. We will have an opportunity for you all to submit um, questions through the Q&A panel at the very end of our presentation, and we'll do our best to ensure that we get all of those questions answered for you all. So today's agenda will include an introduction to your eFolder uh, central team. So we're, I will then be speaking about the evolution of eFolder in our full cloud product suite. I'm going to then be passing the presenter role over to John McCarthy, um, your dedicated account manager for the central region. John's going to then be covering his roles and responsibilities from an account manager perspective. And he's also going to be sharing some helpful partner tips and hints. And then we're going to be closing up the webinar with some partner resources and our contact information. And we will again have a Q&A opportunity at the end of the webinar for you to submit questions um, through the Q&A panel. All right, excellent. So introductions. Um, so we do have a full team here at eFolder dedicated to our partner success. Um, that team for the central region includes John McCarthy, account manager, Melissa Guzmier, myself, I am the territory manager, and we have a whole team of sales engineering uh, members, but Joshua Krishman is our manager for the sales engineering team. So let's talk a little bit about the evolution of eFolder. So just to refresh, um, eFolder actually started off as a value-added reseller um, serving the Atlanta market. It gave the company a lot of inspiration to exclusively move over to serving the IT channel. Um, so there are three key data trends and three workforce trends that are that started to shape our strategy and that are still shaping the e-folder strategy and direction today. So explosive data growth. So data volumes are continuing to grow rapidly across all market segments. We've got data complexity. So with bringing your own device, file sync technologies, mobile computing, data now lives in numerous places and is becoming more and more complex to maintain and to govern. We have legal and regulatory compliance, so strict compliance and legal requirements are increasing relevant for SMBs and enterprises alike. We have evolved SMB requirements. So SMBs that view technology strategically have many of the same requirements as traditional enterprises. We then have to factor in mobility um, as work styles are changing. Um, employee distribution and, and the complexity of securely and privately managing corporate data is just becoming more and more um, of a challenge as folks begin to work remote. We then have cloud and SaaS adoption. So really just that's growing really rapidly and just enhancing productivity while stressing IT resources in the areas of privacy, security, and business continuity. So eFolder, we offer solutions that are designed to meet your needs. The most comprehensive backup and data protection suite in the IT ecosystem, ranging from business continuity, backup, including cloud to cloud backup, data protection, all the way to mobility and file sync and share and collaboration solutions. So let's talk about the eFolder 
product suite. We have Anchor. So Anchor is our secure file sync and share solution. Um, it's rather robust in addition to it being that true collaboration solution uh, for your clients. There's also features like file and folder backup, file server enablement, cloud enabling a file server. We have our Replibit Axiant backup and disaster recovery solution. That is your end-to-end -end BDR solution. Um, On-site appliance, backing up locally, replication to the cloud, and then multiple recovery options in the event of an on-site disaster. We have Cloud Finder. So Cloud Finder is our cloud-to-cloud -cloud backup solution. Backing up right now, Office 365, mail, calendar, and contacts, with additional um, items being backed up in the near future, things like OneDrive and SharePoint being added to the solution uh, sometime in the next one to two years. And then we have backup. So backup is our file folder business grade data protection solution. So it differs from Replibit in the sense that it is not image-based. It is just that file folder backup, um, but it is flexible in the sense that you can back up your files and folders straight to the cloud, or you can loop in um, local backup if you wish, like with a NAS device, um, but it does offer that business grade data protection for files and folders. So we're just gonna dive you know, from a high level into each of the four solutions um, within our cloud product suite. We have Anchor, so again, our secure file sync and share solution. Um, you know, really what Anchor does is it empowers, you know, your clients to sync data between multiple devices and the cloud. So that could include their workstations, their laptops, their, their iPhone, their Android phones. And we have options for both the eFolder cloud or if you wanted to host in your own private data center. Um, that is also an option. One other thing to note um, about Anchor is that it really was designed for the MSP in mind. So you have the ability to um, customize every single client organization with um, whatever settings you want to give them. You can add your logo or add their logo. Um, and it's multi-tenant as well. So you can manage all of your individual client accounts from a single dashboard, making it really easy to set it up, to deploy out to your clients, and to manage. Um, also previously noted, um, Anchor is robust. So in addition to it being that secure file sync and share solution for your clients, um, there also is additional features that make it that robust solution. So it has file server enablement, which is essentially your cloud enabling um, a file server. So you're giving your users the ability to access um, documents from the cloud from any device, no matter where they are. Um, there also is a file folder backup component to Anchor. Um, so it can also be treated as that file folder backup in addition to it being that um, secure file sync and share. So it's very robust, designed for the MSP, and really set up for our partners to um, customize and to um, allocate out to their clients as needed. So we then have our file folder backup solutions. This is business grade uh, data protection. So again, it is that file level backup. Um, you can back up workstation servers, laptops, and you can even um, incorporate NAS devices if you wish. You have the ability to customize your backup scheduling and have access to um, previous versions and you control or you customize the retention of backup. And you also have multiple recovery options um, as well um, from the cloud. So you can download, we can get you a disk shipment, um, or you can utilize the eFolder Continuity Cloud, which is an on-demand service that is needed in the event um, of an on-site disaster. Like Anchor, um, file folder backup is also brandable. So again, just 
um, giving you more customization and the ability to brand the solution as your own for your clients. So Cloud Finder, our cloud to cloud backup solution. Um, right now, Cloud Finder backs up Office 365, so mail, calendar, and contacts. Um, one of the main things that separates Cloud Finder from the other cloud to cloud backup solutions out there is the smart full text search functionality and uh, rich filtering. So it gives you the ability to type in a word or a phrase and search um, across all items um, to pull up whatever you're searching for. Um, it also gives you the ability to do, it, it includes automatic backups, as many as three per day of Office 365. Um, you can do instant restores and you do have that very user level um, flexibility. And then we have Replibit our end-to-end -end backup and disaster recovery solution. So this slide will just give you a little bit of a preview as to how Replibit works. Um, so we have our uh, workstations being backed up by our production servers, and then our local backup, our BDR appliance on-site. So with Replibit, we do require an on-site appliance at each client location, but Replibit is flexible. We allow you to bring your own hardware um, if it meets the minimum hardware requirement, or you have the option to purchase um, pre-configured um, appliances from eFolder that come with three-year warranties, Replibit already installed, um, and they're ready to go. So you do have options to bring your own hardware if you wish, or to purchase new from eFolder. We then have replication to our offsite or to the cloud, so you can pick the eFolder cloud, um, or you can vault to yourself if you have that infrastructure set up and ready to go, or you can do both. So we do allow multi-vault replication as well. So again, just offering further flexibility if partners um, want to, you know, vault to themselves or eFolder. Now, in the event um, of an on-site disaster. If you're um, replicating to the eFolder cloud, you do have multiple recovery options um, from the cloud, which include you know, a download, a disk shipment, or again, utilizing the eFolder continuity cloud that is an on-demand service um, that we provide. So a critical ticket would be submitted. We have a one hour or less SLA to begin spinning up a dedicated node in our cloud. Um, we then begin transferring those images, the data, um, over to that dedicated node from our cloud, and we get your end users um, up and running and access to those VMs that are running in our cloud. So it is an on-demand service purchase in seven-day increments. Um, and of course, if you're only vaulting to yourself, then you would have the ability to recover um, from your own um, data center, or from your own infrastructure, or your own server. So in closing, um, I hope I've shown you a little bit of what we're offering here. You know, we do have um, a very comprehensive and powerful suite of data protection uh, solutions. You know, we want to provide our partners with a very solid foundation uh, to be successful. And we'd be honored to show you any solution that you're not already utilizing. Um, we can run through any personalized demos um, after the call. We will be providing our contact information. And I want to thank you for your time. I'm going to now pass it over to my colleague and friend, John McCarthy, Account Manager for eFolder. Uh, this is John McCarthy. I'm your Account Manager. Um, actually uh, been with eFolder about four years, and uh, but I'm new to this region. I came from an Eastern uh, territory and have moved to a central territory, more centralized in the central time zone. Um, as your account manager, I'm your single point of contact for everything that you have from eFolder. 
and what you do not yet utilize for me folder, Melissa will help you to engage those products. Uh, the things that I do is I answer questions regarding invoicing and billing, uh, get you going in the right direction. I help you to manage support when needed. Um, I would also be able to <clears throat> help you with those product increases and also if there's promotions uh, held by eFolder you could ask me on any of the products that eFolder has that you already own and I may be able to provide you uh, pricing uh, attractive pricing options through promotions. I also would be able to help you if you decided that some trend Training for sales or technical training might be in order, uh, but there are options to that as well. But if you needed training that was more pinpoint to your own needs, I can provide you with a uh, technical resource so that we can uh, have you in front of an engineer and discuss what you need as far as training for eFolder products. And all the products that eFolder has uh, would come through me. So I'm Anchor, I'm all the BDRs, as well as um, File Folder, Backup, and Cloud Finder. <clears throat> um, and then I also, myself, can maybe provide you some help and understanding on reselling the eFolder solutions and maybe offer some guidance on how you're doing that or what you might be able to do to help you to more easily sell or more effectively sell the product. Now, I also prepared today some um, helpful hints on how you can help manage your products yourself. Um, there is live, technical training that's available to you on the eFolder partner portal. Many of you probably are already aware of that, but again and again, I have partners tell me that they were not aware that this was available. And so today I've included a link to that, and I believe we will be sharing these uh, slides with you when we are finished, and you'll be able to utilize these links to help you find um, these particular um, options that might be available to you. So you can get live training. That live training resource is a actual technician and you are on a exchange line so you can actually speak to him, ask him for clarity or ask him to divert to something maybe a little deeper on the subject that he's talking about and he will oblige. Uh, there have also been um, cases where the engineer has found that it might be easier if he would talk to people directly, and he has set up appointments to talk to folks one-on-one -on -one at a later time. Uh, these uh, training services are free. Uh, so all you have to do is schedule them, find the time to make it, and engage. Uh, we also provide uh, seating for all of our BDR functions, um, as, and um, <clears throat> that seating is also free. And the uh, shipping and receiving on standard shipping is free, as well as the return shipping. Uh, there is other shipping options available. Those do cost, and they're all clearly marked in your pricing but I've included a link to help you to set up and manage seating your devices. Um, products, features, and request form. Um, this tells you, or this tells us uh, the features that you want. Uh, so you can go in there and you can actually share with a group uh, the things that you would like to see included in the product that you're utilizing. Uh, you may want to see Anchor provide, I don't know, open air communication. That's 
course, ridiculous, but something that you are not seeing now that you might want to include, you can include on there. All of our updates and upgrades come directly from these features, and the ones that are touched most are the ones that get the highest attention. Um, also, you can uh, check out the status of the products online. So, for instance, if there's a um, an issue at a data center and a um, server bank is down, you can go and look at this particular link and see that everything is green or red, just like you do on your um, uh, backup results that you see for Replibit and Shadow Protect. Uh, and then finally, there's a um, new knowledge base link. I've included that as well. And it has not only just um, articles and video of helpful things, it also has, um, for instance, uh, collateral information that you could brand to yourself. There's uh, a lot available to you, and we welcome you to uh, check those out and um, utilize everything that we have. It'll only help make your experience with the eFolder product that much better. And if any questions come up from those, feel free to call me. There's my number. Uh, you can also see Melissa's number and email address. We are readily accessible to you, and uh, both of us will respond to questions. So if one of us has uh, uh, not replied for some reason or another, and you have an emergency that you feel needs attention immediately, try the other. Uh, see if uh, the other would be able to help you. It's what we do. It's what we want to do. We want you guys to succeed with the product that you have. Success is why Melissa and I are here, your success. And we can help you with that and we want to. So reach out to us. Um, I think that that will about do it. I'm not as long-winded as Melissa is today, uh, but we would welcome any questions that you guys would have. Uh, so if you have any, please enter them into the uh, chat reference and uh, we'll be glad to respond. I think we will turn it over to Amethyst, correct? Or Melissa? Yep. So it's like um, one question came time. through. Um, yeah. And the question is, uh, what would provide an Office 365 user similar functionality to exchange public folders and that would be more um, similar to our anchor solution by providing um, uh, complete folder access or um, drilling down and creating shares and restricting access to specific users um, within an organization. Very good, Josh. Great. Thanks, Josh. Yeah, and if there are any other questions from our attendees, please go ahead and submit them right now um, in the Q&A panel. We'll give it another minute or so. Okay. Well, it looks like there's no other questions at this time. Um, we will be sharing out the slide deck. So if any questions do come up, please feel free to reach out to us. Um, Hold on, I think I see one more, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, yep, we did see one. We only work with um, channel partners, so eFolder is channel only. Now, you know, when it comes down to helping you resell the solutions, we can certainly share, you know, best practices, um, sales and marketing, collateral that's brandable. Um, you know, we may even be able to help you out with an end user demo for any of our solutions if you're looking for a little further guidance there. But uh, we only sell to MSPs, valued resellers, so the IT channel only. 
but you might also be interested in knowing that there are people that do find our website and they do find interest in our products in our website and so those people refer back through a uh, Q&A for products that they find specific and when those are caught marketing will funnel those uh, questions from end users directly back to the account manager usually uh, and at that point we do find a local usually a local partner who might be able to fulfill that need so we do provide uh, customer referrals whenever they come in um, because we don't do direct to client excellent thank you john for adding that in wonderful are there any other questions at this time And you can also call Melissa or I uh, if there are any questions that you have afterwards. We're glad to talk to you. Thanks a lot. Yes, absolutely. Thank you, everybody, for your time. Enjoy your day. Thank you. Have a good day.